Imagine writing an essay with the help of AI. Maybe some of you have even experimented one of these programs like ChatGPT. You give it an assignment, you give it a prompt, like write a book report on To Kill a Mockingbird. And in just mere seconds, it types out the report. It's pretty amazing and it sounds easy, right? Well, a new study is raising questions about what that could mean for your brain in the long run. Researchers at MIT studied three groups of students. One group used ChatGPT to help write their essays. Another used Google search engine to write the essay. And a third group relied only on their own brains, no tech tools at all. And here's what they found. Scientists used brain scans called EEGs and they saw big differences. In fact, the students who didn't use any tools, they showed strong activity in several areas of the brain, including the prefrontal cortex we just talked about, that's responsible for focus and complex learning, but also what is known as the occipital parietal region, which is back here. That's more linked to visual processing and reasoning. Now the Google search group, they showed moderate or intermediate levels of engagement in those same areas. Meanwhile, importantly, the students who used AI showed much weaker brain connections, meaning their brains simply weren't working as hard. Now, when some students switched from using AI to writing without it, their brain sort of struggled to re-engage. Others who started using AI suddenly did remember more facts, but weren't able to think as deeply. So what does this all mean for you? Well, critics worry that using AI too much could make us, quote, mentally lazy, relying on a machine instead of practicing thinking for ourselves. But on the other hand, supporters compare AI to calculators. We don't do math problems by hand anymore, not very much anyway. They say AI can do sort of the same thing, save time, spark ideas, and help students learn if used the right way. Whatever the case may be, my advice as a dad and as a neurosurgeon is this. Stay curious, challenge your brain however you can, and don't let the tech do all the work.